Claude uh, Melon at the Hotel Beau Rivage. I'm here with the CEO, uh, Philippe uh, Bollet. Mm -hmm. right. Claude Melan is a relatively young brand. I think it was uh, started in 1988. Is that a, a, yeah, eighty two yeah. was the start. Really. I see. Sorry, 19... but that's okay. It's only Nin... six years. Right, <laughs> nineteen eighty two. Uh, but you know what they're pretty well known for is to skeletonize and to kind of you know uh, add some really nice and high end finishing on uh, more affordable movements from ETA and then Baoju. And in the past, they only had round shaped uh, cases from your lap, uh, Leon and. Uh, Yes. Lines. Correct. But now we are looking at their new releases for Geneva Watch Days, which is from their Tortue collection. And where would you like to start? Uh, we can start uh, with ladies because it's uh, an honor to uh, present more uh, the ladies version. And uh, at the same time, the ultimate savoir faire of Claude Melon, which, as you said, is uh, basing. Uh, our work on ETA movement because yes. they are produced uh, worldwide, they are serviced worldwide, they are extremely reliable yes, they are. and therefore when somebody will buy a Claude Milan they will really, really, really buy the savoir-faire and the art of yes. open work yes. rather than a pretended manufacturer. Mm. So we are master of skeleton yeah. and exercising our art on, on uh, ETA movement. So uh, starting with uh, uh, the Tortue Lady okay. uh, it was based and uh, using the key elements of uh, the ETA 2671. Ah, okay. But uh, totally uh, redesigned. A smaller version, right? Smaller it was a smaller version because uh, we, we, we developed this case um, with many comments of our uh, ladies' yes. customer. Um, because there we had a, a strong success with the gents, okay. and uh, sometimes the gents was um, you guys to see. was perceived to be uh, slightly too large, and okay. um, and therefore uh, Pia, uh, who is uh, in charge of the Swiss market, but also in charge of this development, yeah. has uh, had um, many uh, meetings with customers, female customers. Okay. And they, they express um, the three main wishes. Okay. First, they say, stop saying that we don't like uh, mechanics. We love mechanics. Yes. So, but we I prefer think automatic. Have changed already, right? Yes, moved on. We yeah. want something to happen in the watch, and we like curves. So, saying that, we looked at uh, the the uh, shape and size, and thanks to the modern technology of uh, of uh, Presenting different sizes quite yes. easily, the the 31 millimeter size was the most favored oh, okay. from uh, from our customers. So, okay. uh, from uh, from uh, nine to three, it's 31 millimeter. Yes, and then we had to uh, fit a movement, mm. and the uh, two six seven one was the right shape, but too common because a round movement into a tortoise shape is not yeah. ideal aesthetically. You shape it to the case. And so we shaped, not only shaped it to the case, which we did for the gents one, but for the ladies one, we went even further. We wanted to have something to happen in the watch, so we moved the, the uh, rotor yes. up to mirror the, uh, the dial. We created a very uh, interesting shape to uh, reveal the gear train and the balance wheel at uh, 11 o'clock, yes. so there is a, 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 an almost yin and yang uh, curve from 11 to 4, which reveals those key elements. Mm. And the rotor plays its uh, role in animating the watch. Yes, I love, I love the micro rotor, and this one obviously you know, comes with, with diamonds on it, and looks sure. terrible, with the floral motif. What about this gold piece? So mother it's, of pearl it's, it's, on the rotor. it's mother of pearl or on the dine, on the three o'clock bridge and on the rotor. And um, and to make it even more feminine, we uh, we uh, PVD the steel case yes. in uh, in a three end gold. Oh, okay. So it has a it has this soft touch. Uh, usually people yeah. use two N. We use three N to make it a little bit uh, smoother. Yes. And uh, and uh, in a better harmony with the uh, mother of pearl uh, finishes. What's the uh, material of the cabochon? 
It's a, it's a synthetic stone okay. which uh, will evoke the uh, moonstone. Ah, okay. It looks perfect. Perfect complement to the mother of pearl. Shall we Thank take you. a look at move on and take a look at some of the sure a new um, a new execution in the chain space is um is a new uh, cutout yes which will uh, take its inspiration from uh, traditional architecture yes but from uh, the traditional architecture we wanted to uh, to make it uh, more modern yeah. by having a, a ruthenium treatment so ah. the gray uh, modern treatment combined with the uh, the swills of the the, the cutout are really uh, uh, an interesting combination yeah. and this is a new way of design right like, well I, I yes mean, this, a, is this is a new skeleton this is a new skeleton design from this from this piece the one that uh, you are showing on the um, the the pvd case yeah um, is is always the the, the signature uh, of the uh, tortoise skeleton yes. since it's uh, representing the first flag of Switzerland. Mm. Okay. Yeah. All wow. all the uh, the shapes that you can see was the original flag of Switzerland because of the uh, reunification of the cantons. Yes. Wow. Incredible pieces. I have to ask uh, Philippe. Might there be complications one day? <laughs> well. It's not really a complication, but a very um, interesting idea. And um, this interesting idea was to um, um, create windows of time. Ah, okay. Windows of time is a, is a piece that allows you to uh, discover the time in a different way. Okay. So, um, I'll just hold this one while you sure. talk about the white one. The, the dial is actually uh, pierced in two different windows, the okay. two round windows. And you can see also an arrow yes. pierced. In fact, this arrow, as you can see, is the hour hand. And every time the time wow. goes by, wow. you can reveal the full the uh, skeleton time, of the movement. Wow, that's an amazing idea. I think very original, I don't think of any other watch that has uh, You see, I'm not uh, young anymore, so every time I start a new product, if it evokes something, yes. then I, uh, I don't want to do it. I want to do products that are really different. Yeah. Incredible. What's the inspiration behind this? The idea behind this? The idea was really to uh, to find a way to um, to reveal the movement okay. in a in a in an innovative way because as you can see from the back the movement is uh, is uh, fully skeleton and decorated. Yes. And um, uh, it, some sometimes we we can hear uh, people wearing a skeleton and saying, look at the back is is nicer than the front. Ah. Yeah. And, um, which in some cases is interesting. Yes. And um, we wanted to make it a little bit more secret and a, a little bit more um, interesting in yeah. the way that it rotates very slowly. Yes. But every time it rotates, you see something, you see different. something different. Exactly. Exactly. I think it's brilliant. I just like this wave design as well. Yeah. On, on the dial, it looks incredible. Are there only three colors? Red. Well, there are three new introduction okay. of uh, colors, but also we do a uh, uh, millezim. Okay. which is one color for the, the one year uh, of its presentation. It's uh, in the box if we, you want to uh, sure. have a look at sure. the box. Yeah, if you quickly grab it. Okay. Oh. We introduce a very um, interesting uh, Electric color. Electric pink. Electric wow. pink. I think we would like this. For windows of time. Check it out, guys. Electric pink. This is a limited edition. It's it's uh, limited to one year production. Okay. okay. And it is numbered. Yes. So you may so uh, show the right side. Yeah. yeah, on the side of the case band. A beautiful, shocking electric pink strap as well. Yes. Well, thank you so much, Philippe. It was incredible. Thank Looking you at so all much. your new novelties. I'll just put them all yeah. out here. And incidentally, what are the prices on, on some of these? I'll give you Swiss Swiss francs. Um, the Windows of Time uh, retails for three thousand nine hundred. Okay. Um, the Ladies uh, Without Diamonds is three thousand eight hundred and fifty. Okay. Uh, the Diamond version is six thousand eight. Okay. Um, the uh, new Swill uh, Skeleton is three thousand five. Okay. And uh, all pink is four thousand five. Okay.
Well, so as you see, incredible value proposition, I think. Yeah, and something something different. Yeah. All right, guys. If you know you want to check out this brand, Claude Melon, you know from one of the centers of Swiss watchmaking, the Valley du Jou. Like, check these out. Incredible skeleton pieces. I really like the ladies' piece. You know, it's a slightly smaller size. Totally and innovative. Also, yeah, mainly because of the micro rotor. I love yeah. it. It's on the front and not on the back. Exactly. Yeah. It, it, it's part of the of, of the action in the watch. Correct. All right. Thanks so much, Philippe. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you for having us. Thank you. Yeah. With pleasure. Take care, Thank guys. you. Bye bye.